Hi, excuse me. Hello. Give me a moment. How can I help you? Actually, I'm wondering how I can help. I'm interested in volunteering at the library. That's great to know. We have so many opportunities across our public libraries, the National Library, the National Archives and beyond. I'm sure we can find something for you. Do you have any idea what you would like to do? Hmm, not really. Why don't you meet some of the volunteers who can tell you more about their roles? <laughs> That'll be great! Let's go! Let's go! Hello! Hi! You must be the one Lilith was talking about. I'm Saman. Hi, Saman. Tell us why you became a NLB volunteer. So I've been volunteering with NLB for the past two and a half years. I like to express myself artistically and I also want to spread the joy of learning and discovery. Has volunteering enriched your life in any way? Yes, definitely. It has given me a sense of purpose. It has allowed me to connect with my community in a more meaningful way. How have these transformed your life? So it has made me a better person indeed. And it has also made me a better parent to my five-year-old. Thank you, Saman. Bye. I'm ready. Who are you and what do you do? I'm Lydia and I'm a volunteer at the Archives Conservation Laboratory. What I do here is to support the staff in conservation and preservation of paper records, which are part of Singapore's rich history. What kind of skills have you learned as a volunteer? I've actually learned uh, many skills that I would not have learned anywhere else and let me show you them. So I learned how to make this uh, forfeit folder. The material is different from what you actually get from outside. It is very important for the preservation of documents as well as to prevent further deterioration of them. I've also worked with a Japanese heat brush. We use this brush to clean the surface of our documents and this helps to remove uh, dirt and other contaminants. I've also worked with the micro spatula and uh, tweezers. These are used to remove fasteners from our paper records, which is important to prevent the rust from further damaging our paper documents. I can't believe you got to interact with a piece of Singapore's history. This role is quite a page turner, huh? Yep. See you guys. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye bye. bye, -bye. See you. Hi, Tim Fu. Oh, hi. I really enjoyed your tour of the library. Oh, that's really good to know. Thank you. I'm interested in volunteering with NLB. Can you tell me more about why you wanted to become a volunteer? I've always wanted to, you know, uh, volunteer my time for a good cause in the local community. And I want to do something for the local community. Well, library, natural choice. How do you feel about mentoring other volunteers, including those with disabilities? Actually, when you first come in as a volunteer, you're actually stepping out of your comfort zone. So whether you're a person with disability or not, and even for us as volunteer lead, we also had to sometimes step out of our comfort zone. So it's a mutually learning experience for you know, both of us and sometimes can be very edifying, right? Because you learn something that you probably never be exposed to, right, in your day-to-day -day life. Thank you for sharing your experience. It sure is bookmark worthy. Hi, Lynette. Oh, hello. I see you've met our volunteers. It was fantastic! I really feel like volunteering with NLB could be a fulfilling experience for me. Before I decide, I was just curious, are there other opportunities besides the ones I've seen so far? Of course there are! This is just the tip of the iceberg. If you wanted to volunteer, you could start somewhere near your home, maybe at your nearest public library. The public libraries are always looking for volunteers to help make the library a friendly and welcoming space for everyone. If you enjoy working with children, you could volunteer at one of our many children's reading clubs which are located all across the island. And if you're a history buff, the National Library and the National Archives have volunteering roles where you can work with historical or archival material. Last but not least, our libraries are places for everyone, and that's why we also welcome people with special needs as well as persons with disability to volunteer with us. I'm so excited to start volunteering with NLB. How can I sign up? Well, you can sign up as a volunteer on the National Library Board's volunteer portal, or you can look out for one of our upcoming volunteer calls. We are so excited to have you join us as part of our volunteer community, and I hope to see you soon.